Hey everyone, Daniel from Twin Bytes with another tutorial for you. This time I'm talking about the weather icon on your taskbar in Windows 11. Now I made a video on this previously with Windows 10 on how to change or even remove the news and interest feed, which is the weather icon it looked like on the taskbar in Windows 10. But even though we removed that, it looks like in the latest update of Windows 11 now, it came back on its own. So let's have a look at how to remove it and what the limitations are. So if we look down in the bottom left corner of our screen, we can see there's the weather. And even though it was over on the right side in Windows 10, they put it over on the left side. But hovering over it, you'll see that it pops up with the news and the weather and things that you can customize. Now what we used to be able to do was just right click on it and we can go into uh, turn off the hover so at least when you hover over it it won't just pop up and that feature is not there. We can't right click on it. All it does is give us this little menu here. Clicking on your logo takes you into the settings. That's the only thing on here that we have for options. So when we go into settings you'll see here that you can add widgets that's not what we want to do. We don't want to add anything. You're really just customizing. There's no way to stop it from popping up when you hover over it. All we can do is personalize it in here. But if we want to disable it, of course there has to be a way to disable it. So I'll show you that now. If you go under the start menu and go into settings, you can go under personalization, go to taskbar, and here you'll see widgets. It's considered a widget, so simply by turning this off, you'll see that it disappeared from the screen now. A shortcut to that is just right clicking on the taskbar and you'll see taskbar settings. And then here's the widgets and just turn it off. So even though they took away the ability to disable the open on hover, at least now you know how to turn off this widget if you want to. And if you found this video helpful, please do give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.